Hello YouTube, we love our awesome back here, and as for the title page, Wii U pricing, speculation, and other things. I'm gonna, my, my thoughts on Wii, Wii U pretty much. I'm going to talk to you in this video about what I think. I know it seems kind of early to talk about the Wii pricing. We won't hear that for another six months. Who knows? Maybe the next GDC, Tokyo Game Show, who knows? But these are just my thoughts on what the Wii U could be priced at and what the contents in the box could be, what we're going to be getting. Um, here's my thing. Um, I heard you know rumors, more rumors. You know, the rumors will never end. We'll be hearing rumors from here on out. Um, we all know that we use and be amazing. I'm buying it for stay like we all are. Uh, all Nintendo fans are. Everyone in the end of the nation. Um, but first off, I'm going to start off with the pricing. I think the system is going to be around $299.99, $300. I've been hearing rumors about, about, from Iowata. You know, everyone, these are just rumors now. I don't know if they're true. I'm taking, taking it for a grain of salt. I don't know. And he said it could be more than 250 So that means, to me, this is just my take on it, it could be $300. That's fine with me. Because the thing is, Nintendo is affordable. We'll never see a system that's $400 from them. That's just ridiculous. Even $300 is too much for a home console, in my opinion. But for what you're getting, it's great. Nintendo is always affordable. Great first party games. And that's what I'm buying it for first party games. Your new Mario, your new Zelda, your new Smash Brothers, your new Mario Kart. All that shit. Your new Donkey Kong. Country. Whatever you're going to be getting. I don't care. I'm there, Nintendo. Whatever. I'll buy it. Even though I didn't buy the 3DS on first day. But I'm going to be buying a new system on first day. And that's just the way it is. Now, the contents in the box. We could be... Okay, obviously the Wii console. I'm going to be getting a... You know, in this video... I'm, I might make another part to this. I don't know. But I'll, I'll get into the whole thing about the Wii, actual Wii console. And why I was confused with E3. Because Nintendo's press conference this, you know, this year was very confusing. Even they said it. Even they announced it. You know, articles on IGN and everywhere. Reggie and Iowata, I think it was just, I think it was Reggie or no, it was Iowata saying like, we did have a few mistakes in our reveal of the new console. And yes, you guys did. You really fucking did. <laughs> Confused the hell out of me. I thought it was just an actual controller. I was like, this is a per peripheral or whatever. But anyways, I'm getting off track here. Um, the contents in the box. Again, I know it's kind of too early to speculate on this, but it's fun. This is probably my only speculation video until, you know, months, months later, you know, whatever. The contents in the box, I think, will be getting, obviously, your Wii console, the white box. It looks like a Wii. The controller, one controller. And I do agree. I think ECC Wii, you said this in your video, you said we might get a Wii mount in there. You know, who knows, we might get a, a white Wii Remote Plus. It's a lot of the... Uh, videos they were showing on the press conference, people were had their Wii mounts on their tables and their and that new controller. I don't know. We might get a new I don't know. I don't know about a nunchuck though. That's kind of anything I don't, I don't even know about a Wii mote. That's kinda of, you know, every we all have Wii mounts. I you know. We remote pluses, whatever. We all get them impacted in with we party, we play motion now and I don't know. We source resort. But um the thing I'm worried about with this whole thing is the controller. How much is going to cost? I mean, how many controllers do we need? And the screen, we have, you know, the controller looks amazing, but are we really going to be needing just one or two controllers with the system? I mean, I want to play some single player games. I want, I want, what if I want to play Smash Brothers, you know, multiplayer or whatever, you know, I mean, it, if I wanted to buy another controller, how much is, how much is this controller going to cost? $60, $70 for one controller? That's pretty expensive. I mean, I don't see it being more than $60. Keep it affordable, Nintendo. You know, that's just what I think anyways. Um, but now, the games, the games, I'm, I know this is way too early to talk about this because it's not coming up for another year. The thing is, I don't care when the system comes out. It could, be, it could come out at the beginning of 2012, middle of the end. I don't care. But the prices of the games, too. Are we looking forward to $60 games from Nintendo, first party games? Maybe third party games could be 60 bucks. I don't know. First party games could be 50 We don't know. But if we're looking forward to a system that's powerful than the PS3 and 360, I don't know. We could be looking forward to $60 Nintendo games. And that's fine. I mean, I mean the next Mario game, the next Zelda game, the next Smash game, I'll buy, I'll buy it. It doesn't really matter. 
So, um, I know I'm kind of ranting here, but you kind know, of moving on to different topics. But uh, I just wanted to talk about like, you know, the new Smash game that's coming out for the new system. Sakurai said we're going to be getting Smash on the new on the new system on Wii U and the 3DS. We're going to have two versions. Now, this is what's kind of bothering me about the new system and the 3DS. More so the 3DS. You're treating the 3DS to me like like it's a home console. I just want Smash on the new system, on the new Wii U. Smash Brothers is, you know, is a home console game. I don't want it on my home. I don't want it on my hand handheld. <laughs> I want a different experience from my handheld. That's what a handheld is supposed to be, different from your home console. I don't want you know same with like Sonic Generations. That's me. I'm on the 3DS. It's like why don't you just put it on the Wii U? Who gives a shit? I'll buy it. It, it, it just really like it's really worrying me with a lot of these games. Like the new Mario game, if they make another Galaxy or whatever it's going to be called, the new th the new I mean, is that going to be on the 3DS and the Wii U? What about Zelda? You know, it's just really a lot of things are worrying me. I don't know. I've just kind of I never I never been like this with the Nintendo system. I always I have always been excited. Don't get me wrong, I'm very excited for the system, but I just kind of um I also wanted to talk about um. Nintendo's press conference. I was very confused to this entire conference. I was like, uh the beginning was awesome with the orchestra and everything like that and I just felt when okay, fast forward here to the Wii U re reveal. When they showed it they were talking about this the, the controller itself, I was like, Oh sweet, this is gonna work with the Wii. Awesome, that was it. No new console. And obviously I watched tons of videos online and they were showing the actual Wii console in the videos that they were doing. I was like, that's the Wii U? I thought that was the Wii. It looked like the Wii to me. Didn't look anything else when you... Obviously, they have videos now where they're showing it up close. The actual Wii U console. It looks rounder and bigger. Kind of like a smaller version of the 360, in my opinion. Just, you know, white and all that, whatever. Could change over time when they actual sh when they showed the actual finished product. But, um, but yeah, I was kind of disappointed with Nintendo's conference in that aspect. Just... Not showing is very just very confusing, and they should, have, you know, explain it better. Actually, show the console itself, then the controller. I know it's like kind of overwhelming, especially for Nintendo to show that, to you know, show this new brand new controller and then show the console. You know, that's just I don't know, really confusing for me. I don't know what do you, what do your guys' take on Nintendo's press press conference and all? What do you guys? I know I'm throwing a lot of questions out there to you guys, but what do you guys think about this year's Nintendo press conference? How much do you think the Wii U will cost? How much do you think an individual controller will cost? And how much do you think games will cost? You know, that's, this is just my take on it. I want video responses, comments, whatever, down below. Um, but yeah, this whole video is just kind of like me rambling and ranting about prices and stuff like that. But sometimes you have to worry about that type of stuff. So, especially in this day and age and economy and all that stuff. And eh. I don't know. I just want your take. Just, I just want your take on it, guys. So, I'm done. Peace out. Later. Bye.